If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Costa Rica would probably be the place I travel to. Dubai. Uh, I'd go to Colombia. I think I'd go to Milan, Italy. Probably go to the Bahamas. Okay, so I'd go to Australia. I would probably choose to go to the Amalfi Coast, Italy. I would definitely go to uh, Paris. What is up, guys? Thanks for tuning in to my 12th video. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Now today, we're going to be answering that very question. As many of you know, one of my lifelong goals is to visit every country in the world, experience all these cultures, meet new people. But uh, when tasked with the, the question, where would I start? Then it becomes a little bit tricky. If you could travel one place anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? So I asked some UMIS students their thoughts. Here's what they had to say. Uh, my name's Jack, and I definitely would have to say that Costa Rica would probably be the place I travel to for the surfing, the beaches, and the warm weather. If I could go anywhere in the world, I would probably choose to go to the Amalfi Coast in Italy, just because it's beautiful there, and I love Italian food. Like, I could eat it for every meal. Okay, so I'd go to Australia because of the uh, kangaroos and the exotic animals there. Uh, I'd go to Colombia and to break some stereotypes about the nation that's known for its drug dealing. If I could go anywhere in the world, I think I'd go to Milan, Italy, because I always want to go to Italy, but also because my boyfriend lives there, so it would be really fun. So if I could go anywhere in the world, I'd want to go to Thailand, especially Phuket, it looks really beautiful. Uh, I would go to Haiti because I love the culture there and I like helping the kids in Port-au-Prince. When thinking about all these amazing places that people choose to want to go, I couldn't help but wonder, does social media influence that decision? I asked these students, check out their responses. I feel like social media does influence my decisions a little bit on that because there's always like a ton of photo, uh, photos and videos and all different types of media coming from certain locations, whether it be like beaches, resorts, or just like local housing and just seeing videos from locals and, and photos from the area. No, the only thing that's influenced my decision is my stomach because I really like Italian food. I've seen a lot of images and a lot of people who've been there, then it looks really cool, so I probably want to go there. Uh, I see a lot of pictures of people there on social media and I think it's a pretty cool, very historic place, so um, yeah, that's where I go. <laughs> and I would say that social media has uh, affected it because I've seen a bunch of like animals and like safaris on like, Instagram. Not only social media, but when I was traveling in Panama last summer and the tour, the other people we ran into who traveled for a living really recommended it and said it's a beautiful spot and something we have to check out. Um, I would say partly, yeah, because I know, because I grew up living overseas, so a lot of people that I know are like always traveling and Italy and like places around Europe are like always on Instagram and things like that, so I'm definitely like jealous of people that are always there. And it's just like a place I haven't gone yet. No, there's not much about Haiti on social media. Now you guys are all probably wondering, where would I go if I could go anywhere in the world and why? Well, I would choose Barcelona, Spain for the beautiful beaches and the lovely architecture as well as giving me the opportunity to practice my Spanish. Now if you guys remember, way back in my weekend video I noted that I got accepted to study abroad in Spain. I got accepted to study abroad in Spain. Well, I'll be heading there in just over a week. So now I turn it over to you. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? Leave your answers in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm really excited to show you my videos of Europe in the upcoming days. Stay tuned.